yesterday what I did was move that shelving brought it over here for that table over there just swapped them over and what I wanted to do just for these batteries because for some reason the negative cable coming from the MPP solar or the, the brains of it goes to the negative this battery reduces for some reason to 10.5 and all the rest are not too bad like and so what I did was I took the 10.5 battery equalized overnight and then I put it over there where the positive is what I'm looking at now is this battery is the lowest of them all so the question is why is this battery lower than the rest is it the last to charge all the time I'm not too sure is that a possibility um, I've got enough power coming in you can see battery 58 55 but it fluctuates 54 there you go and that's full 53 oh because I'm um but it shouldn't fluctuate like that all the time um never did before what have I got in there so 300, 516 watts coming in, 700. Then 55 on my battery, 54. So, there's power there. It says it's full, but at night time, well, the last couple of, or the last week, as soon as, as, soon as it, uh, the sun goes down, it's dead. One of the batteries is dead, 10.5, and all the rest is okay. So, I think it might be a bad battery, but I've just swapped those over. So we'll see if this one goes 10.5, then that means there's something wrong with charging the system. So I don't know if it's the settings. I've got it equalizing every three days because it was on 30 day. Oh, there was no equalization at all until I set it. Um, I was going to do it every 30 days, but I wanted to do it every three days just to make sure that my batteries are maintained with the cells inside um yeah so and also i had two batteries on the bottom two batteries on the top and then there was longer cables going to the bottom so i thought maybe we're losing efficiency that way and so if i've got all of the wires that short the same length going from one battery to another um maybe the efficiency might be better um with the charging so we'll see all right guys but i'm um, yeah very happy with this uh i gotta make some doors for it and uh so we can just close that up and see you later but um this one coming up with alarm see it's at 12.6 charging it's not not bad I mean, so I'm not too sure what's wrong with the King's inverter. This one's 12.2. That's charging those two batteries there, 200 amp hour batteries on the bottom. This system is charging the 300 amp hour batteries. Those two there. Um, but yeah. All right, guys. So I've got, the, I've got all my freezers and everything going. But I turn them off. I put them on the timer. So as soon as it hits like 5 in the afternoon, 4 or 4.30, these will shut off and they're all frozen and that, that's fine. Alright guys, so just a couple of questions there. If you guys know what's going on with this system, uh, let me know. Um, and if there's anything that I can do with the settings, that would be great. Um, to change the settings to be able to um, sort these batteries out. Alright guys, bye for now.